from San Diego and uh, I've been doing this live stuff. It's not usually in a classroom, it's like in a uh, darker club. Like six years ago when I first started, I started on GarageBand. What is that up there? This box. Little this? Right here. Yeah. This is a MIDI controller. So it's basically... So you've seen like a MIDI keyboard. And a MIDI keyboard is just basically... That's one of these. That, that's a MIDI keyboard. So it's, it's not like a piano, but it, it's a USB driven thing. So every time I press a button, it's sending information to the computer to trigger something within the, the software. <coughs> so the faders work the same way. You can assign this little knob to a fader and have it silence out or do whatever you want with it. You know? mm -hmm. so it goes in depth, but basically my setup is the first six of these. All of these I use, and then all of these little like knob things right here. So, and there's different banks, so like I could use all of this and then go to bank two and use all of this again. And there's four banks, so you can use like like 32 different things. At one time? At one time. Ableton is like what I just did. Ableton, you can do like a DJ set, you could use it to make beats. How long does it take to you like to make one uh, track? To make one. <coughs> In the very beginning, it took one day to make like five beats. To this day, it takes me um like three days to make to make one track. But everyone's different, you know. How old were you when you started making beats? Seventeen. Yeah, I'm twenty-three now. Be friendly with with everyone around you because everyone feeds off each other. So like. You might not know, but you, you might be sitting next to someone that, that could offer you something like very like uh, valuable down the road. If I had any advice to give anyone that's some type of artist or creative is to keep creating every single day, no matter if, um, I don't know, if your peers don't like it or if, it doesn't really matter. Just if you create every day and that's, that's like what you want to do, then there's nothing stopping you. There's literally nothing stopping you. So, if you're a rapper, if you're a, a painter, if you're a, a if you draw, <laughs> what was it like first performing, like in front of people? It was actually it was kind of fun because I was with someone else when I first started, you know, and like we were like like best friends, you know, and um, so it was fun. And it started at like house parties, so everyone's like everyone's already like has the energy and doesn't really care what's going on, you know. And then, but the first like live performance at a venue was uh, was really nervous. Like I was shaking a lot, you know. And